Brittany Griner is back home in the U.S. getting medical treatment after being held captive in Russia for 10 months. But some Republicans, what a surprise, claimed that exchanging her for arms dealer Victor Boot set a dangerous precedent. Well, I'm looking forward to what foreign affairs expert Whoopi the Nazis weren't racist Goldberg's take is on this important geopolitical issue. That you know who, uh, what does that say? My brain just went. <laughs> there, uh, no, no. Why? Only a right-wing sicko would have a problem with this trade. Bob Menendez, Democrat senator yeah. on the Foreign Affairs Committee, came out and said, you know, he has concerns about the precedent this will set. <laughs> I, I think it's just the sheer hypocrisy mm -hmm. of it, because I, I have, and I've said it here, always felt um, conflicted about negotiating with terrorists, because I do think it will encourage a uh, terrorist to grab other Americans and realize that Trump was the president when Paul was arrested and that he was the president for the next two years. So how dare you, former twice impeached, one term president, <laughs> say this, how dare you? Yeah, Republicans say they're not gonna trade terrorists for citizens. And then when Democrats trade terrorists for citizens, Republicans criticize them for it because they're hypocrites. So smartest person in the room, Sonny Hostin, who was a lawyer, doesn't know what the word hypocrite means, which is ironic considering she is a hypocrite. 